This is what we're doing. This is what we're eating. This is grilled, bruh. We are South Africa's number one godly Kimba, Nikki Boy Wonder. The lion is hungry and I'm pregnant with emotion. We got a double smash burger happening here. Lamb la fuck, crispy, salt and pips on top. It's gotta have that air bubbles in the focaccia, mm. that's the vibe. Godly Kimba's going in and going in hard, it's here. People's persons, go binge and welcome to Krill. You wanna join me? See how I eat, see what we do, see what we does. Let's go. Peoples, it's your number one godly gimba, Nikki Boy Wonder, and we are currently in Cape Town. That has blessed us with stunning, stunning weather today. And we are at the Orania Sig Market. If you want to experience the whole vibe, gotta get there early, guys. Come through early, experience the live tunes, the flowers, the crafts, most importantly, the edibles. Feeling a bit pickish, you know the godly gimba is always pickish. So I'm gonna walk through this market, Orania Sig. Cape Town, South Africa, come with me, join me, see what we're going to celebrate today. Let's move. People, this place is uh, packed and chock full with culture here. Yeah? The smells I'm getting is very, very lekker. I'm going to try some of the edibles here. Yeah? Let's walk around and see what else they have to offer. Uh, this is why. Take it home, pop it in the oven, family. Dinner sort of vegan cheddar. Vegan cheddar with a win. Chocolate salami. How? Eating vegan chocolate here, guys. Yeah? Oh, look at the size of this two sisters, bruh. What are you making? It looks like fit cooker. Look some horses. Prawn and crab. Chicken, man, chili cheese, cheese and corn. I must get some, some horses, yeah. Some of these fillings uh, I've never tried before and I really want to get into that. Butternut for one. Wow. Can you give me two potato, two cheese and corn? I like the name of that over there. Eat my meat. Ah. Oh, tongue boys. Check at that medium ray on there, that pinky. Ooh. Are these all your all handmade crafted by yours truly? Yeah, the owner is my father-in-law, but uh, we work together here. Okay. How long are you guys operating already? That's about 10 years. Wow. I'm gonna take one of this one. Now we can get my quality belt on. Huh? Thank you so much. Best cobble loads, breed my own. You guys, bake these all yourselves. Bake I'm just joking, we don't actually do it. Guys, so this is like very vegan friendly, a very vegan friendly place. It's for everybody, you know what I mean? And that's that's quality and that's good. You follow what I'm saying? Do you follow what I'm saying? There's literally like a fresh green grocer farm vibe over here as well. In the middle, in the center. The place is screaming with color, screaming with vibrance. I love it. Yes. How is it fresh? We are at Ash and Jesse Fresh Juice. Tell me what is the best one you have? The citrus fruits. I can give you nachi and Okay, lovely. We have a nachi. Glossed. Lovely. Saving the planet like that. No plastic involved. And I can see the nachis over there actually being juiced. Where do you get your nachis from? Straight from the farm. From the farm, yes. Excellent. Lovely tasting. Tangerine boys. Excellent stuff. That's the process. The juice is superb. Fresh, 100% pure. No preservatives, no sugar added. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You got a breakfast pizza? Oh, oh, nice nice oh you it's yeah. beautiful. Thank you. Have a day. Thank you so much. There's a breakfast pizza, bacon and egg on the tits. It's a lot of pizza though. Oh, is it? Is that a half of the food? Similar principle. Like a bread? Mm. And there's no tomato on it, no cheese, just cream cheese. And then the base is different as well. It's beautiful. You make it. We make it. <laughs> Maybe we can get the breakfast one here with the two eggs on top. Maybe we'll come around and let you. Thank you so much. Scrambled egg and bacon croissants. That is like my weakness. Let's go get something to eat. I uh, want to try different things. So we'll take a bit here and a bit there. Sit down nicely and then just have a taste of each of them. Alright, let's go. Guys, we are at La Roselle. Authentic French scripts. Oh, 
I asked him to make me the best one, and they said I should go for the savory one. These guys are from France. Where in France are you from? Brittany, not from yeah. France. Oh, okay, lovely. I'm good, Mr. Brock. So, to explain to you, you know what is a crepe? Yes, it's a thin pancake. Pancake, pancake. Yes. But the carrot is the savory version. Okay? We import our buckwheat grain from France. We grind it. We make our flour, that you can find here. And then with that, we do our gallet, bread, pizza bag, oh, pizza, bagels, okay. everything made of buckwheat, naturally yeah. gluten. The tool that he's using to make the crepe is called La Rosal. That's the name of the shop as well. <laughs> I thought he was putting hand sanitizer on the crepe. Okay guys, he's done a savory and he's done a sweet crepe for me. I'm gonna dive into it with passion. He's putting it on the board now. It looks so superb, so liquor. Thank you so much. This is called the creme de caramel, no? That's one. The cinnamon sugar, you got your homemade honey caramel vibe in here. And this is the sweet one. From rags to riches, the crepe is beautiful, it's crispy, it's light. Peoples, I've got the full house crepe over here. There's palm ham and there's egg and there's mozzarella cheese. And this is all in a crepe. With our wooden knife and fork, I'm just going to go for gold here quickly. It looks tremendous. And I'm sure that it tastes superb as well. Breakfast, brunch, lunch, supper, full house, savory crepe. Let us know. Stick it here for Anderson Market. It's phenomenal. Thomas! Absolutely beautiful. Thank you very much. Starting, well done. Thank you. Good job. Thank you very much. You're welcome. We appreciate you. There's too many things here. There is so many beautiful things here. I'm sat standing with some horses in my hand. I really want to eat it, but I want to get something else. I don't know what. I, I, the, the, the choices to make here, I don't know. My beautiful love doves, the Kibbe Wanda, the godly Kimba, is at Oranias Market in Cape Town. But Tony is rocking because there's so many things and so many eating things to choose from. It's like a kitty in a candy store with a gimba in a food store, you know what I mean? I'm currently sitting with pho, that's about P-H-O, a Vietnamese dish. So it's like a prati soup with beef in here. Got your rice noodle that I'm busy with here now. Just to be specific, this is a beef and a rice noodle bowl. And it's got all different types of veggies in here. The broth that's on top, there's lemon juice involved here, there's fish sauce. There's some other reduction that she put in here as well. Check the beef, it looks tender and soft. And it's so hearty, warm and flavorful. This is how we operate, eh? Carol is operating a huge yeah, Cape Town. He's doing us great. Fresh crunchy piece of chili just to keep the warm in, keep that tang going. I'm in Vietnam right now. I'm experiencing the whole of Vietnam with this one dish. Filled, filled, filled with all different types of fresh veggies, the chilies that's in here, the flavors, the broth is out of this world, honestly. That's the first time I'm having this dish. I was looking forward to having it and I didn't know when it's gonna happen and guess what? We are now. There's a plethora of goodness inside. I didn't know where to start, what to do, what to buy first. I just went with my heart, as I usually do, you know what I mean? And I stumbled across the fur and I got something else for you as well that we're gonna open up shortly. But for this Vietnamese dish, fur bow it's called. It's number one on the menu. Phenomenal, thank you so much. Next up guys, we've got uh, something that's sort of luxury to me. It's not like massive here in Cape Town, so don't have it that often. I have I've had it once before. At New York bagel in particular, but this is uh, boiled bagels 
and it's uh, called the Californian. So he told me it's basically sushi on a bagel. Okay, you got your cream cheese, your wasabi, your avo and your salmon. All on top of the toasted seeded bagel over here that uh, was boiled in water first, to be honest with you. And that is quite amazing. So fresh and so clean, clean girl. How do they do these things? I thought that you slipped away from me there for a second, but I have him. Cream cheese, have oil, salmon. Something about it is just like it rings true, you know, to everything. Cream cheese, salmon, have a card up here. Tell me I'm wrong quickly. Tell me I'm wrong. The Mavango looks very interesting. The very delight of tropical bliss looks nice as well. What do you suggest that they? This is the most beautiful fruit in the world. Guys, we're going to go for the Mavango because uh, the lovely young lady will be advised us oh, that. Uh... <laughs> so it consists of, guys, mango, pineapple, carrot, macadamia, butter, honey, lime, coconut milk, and crushed ice. Now, can you think of a more tropical experience? Fruity, bursting, quality, freshness, and flavor. Enjoy. Thank you so much, Karen. Appreciate you. Ranes is market, Cape Town, the shakedown, and this is the Mavango. Excellent. Thank you very much, guys. Guys, let us depart from this market now and see what else Cape Town has to offer. Follow me out and I'll take you places you've probably never been before. All right. My people, so the godly gimme is now departing the Oranias of Market here in Cape Town. What an experience. Wonderful time was had. The food that I had was extraordinary, to say the least, honestly speaking, from my heart, not even my opinion. It's the truth. So thank you very much, Oranias of Market. Let's see what else Cape Town has to offer. We're going to take you places that uh, maybe you've never been before. So uh, join me, stay with me. And we'll keep it moving. Let's go.